Collector don't just make dinosaur models. They make detailed replicas of dicynodonts too. For the lowdown on Les Vickia, stick around. We'll tell you more. Hi, Everything Dinosaur here, and today we're going to look at this. The brand new for 2020 Collector Lesvikia Bojani Dicynodon model. It's a magnificent model. It's the first Dicynodon model that Collector have produced. One of just a handful of Triassic prehistoric animal models made by the company. We're going to look at Lesvikia in a little more detail and also discuss this. A small Placerus model that's also available from Everything Dinosaur. It's time to take synapsids a little more seriously by looking at some dynamic dicynodonts. Don't forget to subscribe and to hit that notification button to be part of the conversation. This is the new for 2020 Collector Deluxe Lesvikia Bojani. And what a magnificent model it is. The robust head has been skillfully sculpted, and we love the wet look of the black eyes. The inside of the mouth has been beautifully painted too. This Lesvikia model even has an articulated lower jaw. There are some wonderful skin folds, creases and textures on the large body, which has been painted with muted tones, reflecting the typical coloration we see today in large terrestrial synapsids, such as elephants and rhinos, to which Lesvikia was very distantly related. A subtle dark brown mottling effect has been added to the head, to the flanks and to the broad back of the figure to provide a counterpoint to the muted coloration and to help to highlight the skin textures which can be found on the stocky body. Let's measure the model. The Lesvikia is approximately 19 centimeters long. It's about 7 centimeters high at the shoulders and the midpoint of that broad back is a fraction over 10 centimetres in height. As many model collectors will know, dicynodont replicas are rare and difficult to find. However, Everything Dinosaur also stocks a model of the North American Placerius. This little figure is part of a set of prehistoric animal models, but it can be ordered individually. In fact, many of our customers order two or three of these inexpensive models at a time, so they can build up their own Placerius herd. The models have the manufacturer's name painted on the underside of the tail, but this can be easily painted over using acrylic paint. Measuring around 10 centimeters in length and with an overall height of approximately five centimeters, this Placerius replica makes a fine addition to any model collection. So, how do you go about ordering it? Well, with everything dinosaur, it's very simple and it's very straightforward. Visit www.everythingdinosaur.com. The Placerius figure is found in the Party section. Hover over the Party section and click on the subcategory Party Bag Gifts. Once on this subcategory, scroll down until you find the Prehistoric Animal Models individual product and then click to open it. If you hover over the images showing typical models available, you will see that the Placerius figure is shown. There it is. And on the other picture, if you look on the third row, there's a Placerius once again. Click the Add to Cart button to put one of these inexpensive figures into your shopping cart. To view it, scroll up and simply click on the View Cart button. Once there, check the cart details are correct and select the shipping option. When satisfied, scroll down and click the Proceed to Checkout button. Once on the checkout page, fill in the billing details and if required, a different shipping address. Scroll down and you'll find a message box entitled Delivery Notes Optional. Simply add your request for a Placerius model here and our dedicated packet team will ensure that this is the model that is sent out to you. See, we told you ordering a Placerius was very simple and very straightforward. Collector are to be congratulated 
for introducing a model of a prehistoric animal that had only been formally named and described in late 2018, although its fossilised remains had been known about since 2005, and it was first reported in a scientific paper published back in 2008. Its fossils come from a clay pit located close to the village of Lysowitzia in Silesia, southern Poland. The clay pit consists of deposits laid down in an ancient river system that existed some 210 million years ago. Lesvikia is a dicynodont, a group of proto-mammals which evolved during the Permian period. These quadrupeds were herbivorous and belong to the order Therapsida, which includes modern mammals. The discovery of Lesvikia indicates that dicynodonts persisted into the late Triassic in Europe. The fossilised remains of Lesvikia are at least 10 million years younger than any other dicynodont known to science. It provides the first evidence that elephant-sized dicynodonts were present at the same time as the long-necked sauropodomorpha dinosaurs, the first of the really big plant-eating members of the dinosauria. And, just like these dinosaurs, the skeleton of Lesvikia shows adaptations to supporting great weight. It probably had a more upright posture than the sprawling gates of smaller dicynodonts. After all, Lesvikia was at least 40% bigger than any other dicynodont described so far. Everything Dinosaur has produced a Lesvikia fact sheet providing more information on this late Triassic giant. This is available with purchases of the model from Everything Dinosaur's website. More than a thousand bones have been excavated from the Lysovitsa clay pit. Researchers have been able to build up quite a comprehensive picture of the other types of animals that coexisted with Lesvikia. No large plant-eating dinosaurs have been discovered, but intriguingly, the fossil remains of a 5 meter plus archosaur have been found. This animal was named Smok Vavensky in 2012. Smok was certainly carnivorous. It had a skull over half a metre long, but it is uncertain as to whether Smok was a theropod dinosaur or a Rostikian, the crocodile lineage of the Archosauria. It may have hunted juvenile Lesvikia, or indeed sick individuals, but an adult five-ton Lesvikia was probably invulnerable to attack. Fans of the Dicenodontia are spoiled for choice. There's the Collector Deluxe Lesvikia Bojani, and also the Placeris figure, to add to your model collection. Both Lesvikia and Placerius belong to the same branch of the Dicynodont family tree, the clade Canimeriforms. They are distantly related, although ironically Lesvikia lacked tusks, the anatomical feature that gave the Dicynodonts their name. They are part of the last lineage of these types of proto-mammals. Placerius, and most certainly Lesvikia, were examples of a dead clade Walking. It's really good to see Collector extending the range of late Triassic models that they provide by producing a superb 1 to 20 scale Collector Deluxe Lesvikia Bojani. This excellent figure, along with the smaller Placerius, they're both available from everything dinosaur. More models to consider when creating late Triassic prehistoric scenes. Think of it as double dicynodonts for detailed dioramas. Which brings us to this. Our question of the day. Which late Triassic prehistoric animal models would you put in a diorama with these two dicynodonts? Have you been surprised by the quality of the Schleich Postosuchus? Or is it the Collector Platysaurus prehistoric life model that you think is a perfect partner for these two dicynodonts? Or what about the Wild Safari Prehistoric World Steel of Isis? Or maybe the Postosuchus from the same model range? You tell us which models you think work best with the Placerius and Lesser Vicia. We'd love to hear from you. Put your comments in the video description notes down below. So there you have it. A lowdown on the new Collector Deluxe Les Vicia model. Plus how to get your hands on a Placerius too. We'll be announcing new for 2021 figures from Collector in a few weeks' time. Make sure you check out Everything Dinosaur on social media to hear about that and also to stay up to date with new models and replica introductions from other companies. In the meantime, 
we'll put a link in the video description below to the Collector Deluxe section of our website so you can pick up a Les Vickia or two if you want to. We'll also include a link to the individual prehistoric animal models on Everything Dinosaurs website. That's where you can pick up a Placerius. We'll also put a link in the video description below to a blog post from a few years ago which discussed the naming and discovery of Letwickia. Our blog is full of amazing articles on prehistoric animals, paleontology, fossil finds and dinosaur discoveries. We heartily recommend it to you. Thanks for watching this short video. We hope you've enjoyed it. Oh, and one more thing. Thank you.